I bumped into? A Midnight Ranger. Ah, Rover, you're finally here. So you're the Rover, huh? Delighted to make your acquaintance. This is Yuhu from Jinzhou. Like Mr. Chenpi, she's an expert in antiques. That's me! To uncover clues about hidden antiques, of course. Since Mount Firmament reopened, Master and I noticed artifacts from there popping up in the market. Aside from Court of Savante gadgets, there are still plenty of mystery items that don't exactly scream Mount Firmament, you know? So... So I'm betting they're from the port city of Guishu. Yes. I remember you mentioned wanting to learn more about your past ties to the Black Shores. The battle in Norfolk Barrens is over, and the Black Shores should be withdrawing. But they've asked the Midnight Rangers to monitor the area around the port city of Guishu. I thought this might be your chance to gather more information about them. Huh? Y you uh, brought it up before. Aw, oh, Yang Yang's got a soft spot for you, huh? Are you her special someone? Oh, come on. I... I just know it means a lot to you. Relax, I'm just teasing. So, you're tracking the Black Shores too? Since we're on the same trail, how about teaming up? Let this master be your guide. You and me, dream team. Nothing's gonna slow us down. Not to boast, but epic adventures tend to have a way of finding me. Since Rover's here, let's talk to that bloom bearer first. Weird. These parameters are correct, but nothing's happening. What's going on? Yes. Need something? Oh! Uh, so, you're the one Alto invited earlier. Oh, sorry. I, I didn't recognize you. Golden pupils and this Blake Bloom. Yeah, it's you, all right. I'm Nia, a bloom bearer from the Black Shores. Didn't expect to meet someone as important as you under these circumstances. I know it's unusual, but could you help me out now that we're working together? Really? But Uncle mentions you'll be joining soon. Actually, we're monitoring abnormal parameters and detected a problematic frequency that needs to be taken back to the Black Shores. The port city of Guishu was decimated by the lament. If this frequency goes unchecked, it could trigger another catastrophe. Yes, that's why the Tether system sent us to locate and recover this frequency as soon as possible to prevent a potential disaster. Our agents relayed the coordinates, but... Since then, I've lost contact with them, which doesn't sit well. 
I'm stuck here monitoring. Can't leave my post. Do you think you could help check out what happened? If things aren't looking good, we might need to inform Jinjo City Hall, like we did before. They will need to act fast then. That's the worst case scenario. If we contain the frequencies that Tether's system advises, nothing bad will happen. I want to help her. As an outrider, it's my duty to safeguard the peace. Thank you. It's reassuring to have a Midnight Ranger with us. I'll send you the coordinates of the abnormal frequency. Could be the reverberations or something in the sonorospheres. In Solaris, frequencies can be anything. One thing's for sure, though. This frequency represents gravity. It's abnormal because it has its own gravitational center. You should be able to feel a palpable anomaly near it. That's how you can locate it. I trust you'll handle it smoothly, but remember, your safety matters most. Don't hesitate to retreat if you run into any real danger. And once you're back, we'll hurry to the Black Shores to upload it to the Tether system. Oh, I forgot you haven't been to the Black Shores, have you? No worries. Sense the presence of tacit discords below. What's the big deal? Just some pawns. I won't even break a sweat. Something feels different about them. Be careful. Here comes Master Yu! <laughs> The agents Neil was waiting for. What happened here? Hoda, 
My name is Hoda. This is my name. I once lived under it as a bloom bearer. Frequency there is an extreme chaos. It's dangerous. Hold on! Hey, what's happening? It's starting to glow! It must be from the Black Shores! Look at this! I need to learn more about this thing. My master and I guessed it's from the Black Shores, and now it looks like we were right! The abnormal frequency definitely links to the deaths of those bloom bearers. Now it's hiding in this object, but I can still feel its strong attachment to the Black Shores. Solving this issue is beyond our capabilities. Besides, they also mentioned Rover and the fall of the port city of Guishu. We should meet with that bloom bearer first and explain the situation. This is best left to the experts. Let's go. I have a bad feeling about this. I sense there's more to this than meets the eye. Port City of Guishu must hold secrets waiting to be discovered. The wandering traveler. At last, you have returned. Here, the story both ends and begins anew. I am pleased to see you back on these shores.
Wherever you venture, be it Huang Long or Rinasita, I will always be here, waiting. No matter how far you wander, you will always find me here, on these black shores. I shall lead the way. Jinzhou are filled with riches. As far as the eye can see. so thick. I can't even see you. Because you're at Veiled Rock. Your vision is veiled. Now, how about explaining what brings you here, uninvited guests? What? Huh? Is, it, is it really you? No, no. Don't lose me a dream. <laughs> At last, you've come to me, to the Black Shores. Precisely. But how did you manage to get here? I see. The situation doesn't look good. That Hoda might not be one of us. But I'm curious. Could I have a look at that item the antique dealer gave you? Huh. Didn't expect to see it outside Mount Fragment. A monitoring register. We Black Shores members place these around the world to keep an eye on the Sentinels. If anything happens to them, we'll know immediately. Hmm. Looks like it was also used to record abnormal frequencies in the port city of Guishu. Maybe the Tethys system has a soft spot for you. But, without more details, I can't say for sure. Since your arrival, has anything unusual caught your eye? A person in light blue. Huh. Could it be the shorekeeper? Yes. The elusive guardian of the Black Shores. Who is said to be always watching our true leader. Shielding us from danger. It seems you've had quite the encounter. In times of great adversity, the shorekeeper will reveal herself and support our true leader. Who? At the destined moment, will arise to save and guide the Black Shores. 
fantastical or not, that's all we've got to go on. Hmm. There must be a reason she went to such lengths for you. <clears throat> anyway, let's not get carried away. We should head to the greenhouse. The abnormal frequency you collected needs to be uploaded to the Tethys system as soon as possible. In order to avoid another lament in the port city of Guishu. Given that we've already lost enough of our own to it, we need more bloom bearers to handle this. As for the information you're after... <sighs> it's already spread this far. Seems like the Tethys malfunction is getting worse. We need to hurry. Time is one luxury we do not have. Let's save the rest for the road.